So my friends, I've got good news and bad news in Mob Factory. The good news is the game came out on early access. The bad news is that my old world is gone. But thankfully, I've spent the last couple of hours building up the biggest factory that I've ever made. Look at all these spiders coming out and going immediately into the poison zone. Yeah, they get cooked into there, and then all of the webs flow back this way. Same with all the little wormy guys. Look at all of them go. We are killing approximately 554 worms per minute, but 849 spiders. Also, one dragon. He's kind of going the way of the dinosaurs. But then he magically respawns after spitting out a tooth. I don't know how that works, but I'm not going to ask questions. Now, the thing is, I can buy an island right here immediately, or I can buy this one way on the other side of the world, and I'm not going to lie, I'm a little bit concerned. But I have way enough platinum, so let's just YOLO this and see what we can get. All right, this gives us the trash goblin, right? Yep, items fall into the grates. Rats increase the w to up to wave 15. All right, so we get a whole bunch of, of rats, and the rats spawn in apple cores, if I remember right. That just means I get to buy a whole bunch of things. That is 3,000 spider webs for every one of those, but we had 400. Yeah, we'll buy a couple of those and then maybe a few of these. My goodness, I didn't realize it has 20,000 of them. But one other thing is interesting is since we have the new upgrade, we have the new multi-shot, the totem, and there's a big cannon with some sort of heart in it. I can also do a couple upgrades from like my conveyor and my intakes. And then the assembler production speed increases. This is working well, cauldron. So let's see what we can do to kill a bunch of rats. First off, let's make our wiggly maze of fun. And if I remember properly, these things aren't too terribly difficult to kill. But let's just make sure. We'll put a crossbow at the end, just for funsies. And you know, one of these things right here, just to blast them in the back. All right, little rats. Oh, they're getting fumigated as well. Oh my goodness, why did you go over there? That's illegal, you're not allowed to do that. All right, uh, you know what? Do they just fall in? No, they can attack too. Balls, I didn't do it right. All right, um, 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 All right, we need, we need more death-defying devices. You know, it also might help if I give them some slowing devices. Mm, let's pop in one here. And uno mas, por favor. That's French, if you were wondering. Okay, is this working now? Oh my goodness, these things have... Okay, I killed one, I killed two, I killed three. Good. So now we just get a buttload of apples that fall down into the grates for the rest of infinity. That's also a stupidly expensive, like, water slide of death. Okay, so let's buy another island. That, I don't even know what that is. Is that where the mimic comes from? Or is this a uh, new... I don't know, I could buy it. Do I have enough killing devices for it? Maybe not, should I just buy this one? I don't need any more, I don't need any more apple cores, so. All right, I don't really have too much. Let's see what else I can buy. We have some long range turdy boys we can get, or we can get a few more of them, some more slows. Uh, we'll get a long range thing, sure. We'll just spend all of our money. And then we'll make do with whatever spawns in here. A mimic, yes, drops more after it eats any item. Okay, cool. So the idea is that we bring the conveyor belt that way so these apples flow up into here and then we'll just inject it into the water slide of death. I also don't remember how to kill these the best. So let's make sure we slow them down nice and hard. Then we're gonna inject their backsides with arrows. I could also use some cyclops against the arrows like such as. We can put you in there. Oh, that's all my Cyclops. All right. Thankfully, I have enough crossbows, maybe? We have some of these crystals, too. All right, Mimics. Teach me a lesson. Actually, don't. I'm kind of scared of you. Not gonna lie. I also have to sneeze. <coughs> Do you like that one? That was a sneeze. Bless you in comments. All right. Mimics are coming through. Oh, poop nuggets. Mimics, you're not allowed to go that way. That's against the rules. Oh, balls. That's against the rules, too. Hey, stop it. Be dumb. Stop. Okay. They went that way now. All right. You're kind of needing to go back and forth and back and stop it. No, not allowed. Okay, mimics go this way. Cool. That's proper now. Why are there so many of them? One of them ate an apple. Good. And it's dead. But one of the mimics made it. Hey, the good news is we got a bunch of those things out of it. So they're just eating properly now. Okay, is it working? Is it, is it, it's working. Good. We don't even need these. Perfect. So something else we can do is get an advanced sorter going in here and we can pop in the advanced sorter down in this direction and we'll sort out all of the chest cores 
and that's gonna spit off everything else to the side. Once we do that, we'll put in another cauldron. Okay, this hopefully will go to the right. It does. All of the apples will go in and start getting cooked, and then we will make applesauce out of it. Woo! Sounds delicious. I have another idea. What happens if we just remove that one? Then it's just gonna pile up apples in here. The mimics are still gonna walk through, and then they're just gonna <laughs> nom on some applesauce. <laughs> Good job, proud of them. That's exactly what we need. I don't think we need those either. Excellent, we didn't need them all. Great, that looks like it's working really, really good. I really don't know why I need five or 600 of these potions, but science, right? Can I get any more upgrades with them? Um, No, because I need more of the yellow potions and we only get that from these dragon teeth, I think. Yep, yellow's only from dragon tooth, but we can get rings, chest cores, and eggs. Hmm, that gives us the purple ones. And now that we're getting chest cores, we can get the piercing turrets as well as the multi-shot. Is that like a shotgun? I'm not exactly sure, but I wanna buy like a couple of these. Now, also, if I remember properly, these require electricity, which we need to get rolling. And we do that in tier tree number two. Did we max out one? Interesting. We got two. Magic assembler. We have mana poles. And then the mana pressure plate. So this generates the mana. We can also do the underground. Nice. So I don't have to have spaghetti like this mess. This is really interesting too. Whatever is next, it requires blue gems and I have no clue how to get those unless it's through mana. So I'm gonna craft up a pressure plate. Let's get a mana pole and then a uh, magic assembler too. And I think these rats over here might be our very first, uh, I don't even know what to use the word. Crash test dummies. We'll put that mana thing in there. We get a mana pole and then we have the assembler. We'll have to look at that. So that should move to, hmm. I can put it over here and it'll generate the power. And then we could use the new piercing turrets, something like this. Okay. It didn't, it's not a long enough tunnel for them. But if I remove that piece, it could shoot. We can't move that piece. But we do get a dingus that just kind of hangs out until he dies. So it kind of works. I think things are dying not as fast. My goodness. I really need to come up with a way just to use long straight shots because that's got a pretty good range. So let's mess around with some more rats. Now I am kind of interested to see what kind of damage these do on their own. So let's pop in some slows over here. And we could pop in a slow over here too. Could we just do this with uh, two? All right. Nope. And nope. Okay, that didn't work at all. Like not even close to working. The slows didn't do anything. All right, so real talk, what happens if we add four of these in properly? Nope. Okay, that was really not a good choice. There we go, that should be better. Uh-huh. Tell me again why you don't wanna die. Okay, that hit all four of them which was good. Come on, fire again. I probably could use a Cyclops back here instead of that one. Is that drawing enough power? I don't know. Oh my goodness. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm gonna straight up die. Not in real life though, if you were wondering. That'd be bad. The good news is these, oh, I killed one. I killed two. Yeah. Really? Um, what? <laughs> Why do we use all of that? I feel like these might not be the, the most efficient things. 100% grid efficiency, so it's working. They have a really long cooldown time. That's the bigger problem. And why are you just vibing here, bro? I don't think we have enough power. Okay, I think I figured out how to use this thing better. You need it in long runs. So it just pierces everything. Problem is then I don't get uh, power to it. I wonder if we can transfer power over. Like, could I put a power thing in here somewhere? Let's look, where do these die first at? They die right in here. Let's see, let's build up a couple mana pressure plates and a couple more mana pulls. Now we have a trash rat coming in. Why do you not die? They're dying that time, I don't know. All right, so we get power from over here and transfer it to uh, over here. Does that work? Generated 10, generated zero. It's connected though. Okay, so all of that's connected now. I can remove those and put in conveyors. It looks like they're vibing, they're, they're using, okay those shots so that did work cool so that's neat let's uh look at the magic assembler too and see what we can use on this waiting oh okay there's the gems the gems so we need a tunneler to make a gem and a tunnel is 
Slime balls plus core chests. This is really dangerous because I need to combine the core chest or chest cores with the slime balls, meaning that we have to get over here. That means I'm gonna have to redo all of this and then bring the stuff over. So, wow, okay, <laughs> I don't like this because I have to remove this entire structure and then redo it this way. Do it. All right, all right, I'm scared. You know, that might not have been as bad as I had thought it was going to be. Let's see, does this kill? We should probably double check here just in case it doesn't kill. Come on, get fumigated, you stinky little creatures. They didn't die. All right, cool. Well done. None of them died, you dirty little rats. Like actually, they're they're rats and they're dirty. How come that doesn't work now, game? Am I gonna die? Please don't die. All right, I'm killing some of them. Cool. All right, that thing shot. It's shooting a couple. Is it gonna work? Did we kill them all this time? Okay, good. They're dead. Nope. Not all dead. Fine. I'll just buy another one of these. Just kidding. <laughs> I'll just buy, put one of that roll, zoom in. Thank you. Okay, we'll do that. Oh, they all died that time. All right, we good. So I'm gonna build up a bridge. We'll use that bridge to pop down across this way. Just kidding. We'll use it to pop down against this way. Excellent. We don't really need these things. Another rat just got through. Had to have been here. Okay, I need to craft a couple of tunnels on my own. I've never used these before, so you'll have to bear with me while we figure it out. Now the objective here is that we need to build like this over here. We're gonna have to sort off all of the apple cores because there are a few extras that pop in. So if I do the apple cores, let's see. No, we need to put these through. Insufficient. I don't need to buy the island, you dingus. I don't want to do that. But how did a dumb rat get through again? I want to sort this. Okay, it's sorting. Okay, those are going. If the apple cores come through, then they're gonna come this way and in. And then if they're gonna come in this way and in, we need to bring that over into here. Okay, I also don't wanna send the chest cores in. We wanna bring the chest cores this way, this way, and then we need this here and that there. Okay, so let's do a little bit of that. Feed it into there. We're gonna bring you over. Now we need to bring in these things. Uh, I definitely don't want to feed that. Okay, those work perfectly, good, okay. All right, so all of these are dying. All of the slimes are dying, which means I can bring this up and over. We're gonna bring that in here, over here. So we need to combine the, in the magic, we have to use the magic. Can this work? It's when stepped on, okay. So we'll just force this up. We can actually pop that one out, put this in. We'll build up another magic assembler. Actually, we could just use the one that I was testing over here. Give me you. Okay, I wanna put the magic assembler. Mm, I can't quite. I mean, we could put it right here, that's fine. Let's grab the chest cores. We will drive you down here, over here. We'll drive you over and up. All right, and then we're gonna tell you to start building gems. Shoot, we can't have gems because that takes the tunnels and the tunnels takes the gems in the cores. So magical assembler there, magic assembler there. We'll combine these two together like such as. This one's gonna make the tunnels, which is six and five. And then this other one, we are going to run a tunnel from here. Craft another tunnel manually. Grab that bad boy and make it go. I can't have it go that way. It needs to go up. Okay, so we'll just craft up another bridge. Come on, bridge, grab the bridge, slap her down like such as, and then that's actually easier. All right, so you dorks make me a tunnel. Okay, I need to make sure, I don't wanna get too many here. Why is it taking so much? Do we not have enough power? Okay, I can't actually see what's happening in here. I need more power though. I feel like Tim the Toolman Taylor. I'm gonna start grunting uncontrollably. Okay, tunnels are going in. You start need to make us the gems. Gems are being created. That's actually terrifying. We need 10 blue gems on there. The other worst part is that these are overflowing. So if they're gonna overflow, we're gonna do this. Ah, <laughs> okay. That one's got a bad case of the dumbs. Cool. 
All right, so a little overflow, overflow spillway to get the rest of the flood water in. We just took a rat damage again. I don't understand where that could even come from. Oh, and this is cute. We can't build there. You got, all of you got a big case that's stupids. Come, come here. All right, good. Those are flowing over. Very nice, very good. All right, I think we did it. Did we make our blue gems yet? We haven't made one yet. Crafting, yeah, uh, grid efficiency. You don't have power. I need to bring you the power. Yes, yes, there's our gem. <laughs> we did it. Oh my, they're coming quick. We got two gems now. Sick. That also really makes me want to buy whatever other weapon this is. Because it's called a multi-shot. Shoots in all four directions. Requires magic. So do I. Except I don't shoot in four directions. I also don't have magic. But we could put it in. It shoots in all fours. Interesting. So I could like plop it here. And it would bloop. Hmm. That's really unique. How do you, How does a person best use something like that? Because it shoots forward and back. Huh. Yeah, I mean, everything's dying now. Must do a lot of damage too. Good. So those are dead. Just kidding. Where am I taking rat damage from? Stupid, dumb rats. I hate them. Every one of them, even the women rats and the children rats. But if I could use another one of those here. So like plop it in right like that. Interesting. We're getting more power, so that's cool. The dragon's dying still. Poor dragons, died like a thousand times. Wonder if we can afford any more upgrades to our conveyor system? We can. Wow, it takes forever to make those gems up. Okay, conveyor. We need one more for conveyor, but I do want the assembler upgrade. And there is no way for me to buy another one of these islands that I've found. Hey, this is the one that took damage. Huh, weird. I don't like it. It must just be some weird miss. Okay, cool, whatever. So I've still got 75 platinum coins. I'm gonna use that to buy this. Oh, that's a terrible idea. Okay, we could feed this one. Yeah, that's not too bad. We could feed it the apple cores back around. I just have to kill all of these chests again. So let's buy a few more of these multi shots. Five, six, six. I can afford six. I still can't afford any of these, which is really sad because those are my favorite. But now that I have piercing weapons, I might be able to set up a piercing farm for skeletons. I have no idea if this is going to work or not. Why do the stupid rats keep getting to my house? It's so dumb. Uh, this could go really, really bad for us, but let's put one of these in here. Maybe it has, it doesn't have power, but if I put another mana turret in, it should. Okay. I don't have enough money to buy anything else either. So let's just hope I kill all of the mimics. Okay, they're generating power. Good. All right, that's working pretty well. We got one down, two down. Kill a third one. Come on, come on. They don't have power. They don't have power. They don't have power. Because there's nothing generating the power. I mean, it worked. It needs to have more power generated. I wonder if there's a way I can pump in more power over here. Oh boy. Well, I don't need that. Yes, I do because that stops. Oh man, there are no islands over here either for me. And there's no battery system. Oh, there's the mana battery. Okay, I figured there would be one. Can I buy any more of these? I can't, but I can buy another one of those and a couple more of them. All right, that should help out significantly. I mean, it makes sense, right? If there's no power, how can the things be powered? And I remember that's why I didn't do that. All right, I feel bad because I bought these brand new things and they're like, yay, I want to walk. But if I put in, uh oh, if I put in a pressure plate over here, all of the resources are just going to get abandoned on it. I guess they'll eventually get pushed because it'll just stop on it. But then the next resource should push it. Neat. We got, oh, hey, you know what? That actually kind of functioned properly. Woo! All right, we'll just add some of these in because then it'll they'll walk on the pressure plate and then get blasted by the bad guy. Yeah, 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 perfect. Ow, I got hit. What did I get hit with? Another rat. Really? <laughs> that's so annoying. All right, so that's excellent. That thing is working as intended now. Good, that piercing thing is really cool. I kind of want to put another piercing around here. Let's try it. Should we try it? I want to try it. As long as it has power, which it should. It might not, but it might because we're still getting some pressure plates. Let's grab one more. Okay, ooh, that functioned. Hit it again. I ran out of power. All right, we're gonna put it in power here. Okay, it's working. It's worked. Perfect. Good. Ha ha ha, I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, hit that one. Good. Hit it again. Ah, uh, okay, it hit two of them. Perfect. That one's good. 
That's cool. I like the electric. And we did it. And we probably have a buttload of gems so we can buy the next island in the next video. So thanks, my friends, for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, let me know and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all of my patrons and channel members, including Ben, Otto Dave, Dicky J, Teddy Hippius, Ninja, General Harris, Trent M, Kodina, Ritla Warrior, Keegan H, Zarna, Baxter, Rao, VC Engineer, Sakars Rings, Spencer T, Whiskey, My H, Splatter Sex, Doug Rules, Skunk Chess, Brad Dolphin, Sikander D, Zane W, Mr. Cripple One, Peyton Place, Fussy Badge, Sniper, Link, Kyler J, Jaden A, Nitro VR, Nitrox, Eli M, Toxic Wolf, Rune, White,